Morning guys, it is August 13th, 2021. This one I got a call from a guy. He says his AC is cooling, but not cooling like it used to. And that's what he told me. So, still working. It's not iced up. What he said. But it's not cooling like it's so. I told him if it ices up, you gotta shut it off for a day. Supposedly, he's been keeping an eye on it, so. We'll find out. Maybe she needs a little douche room, Mama. Miss Molly. Maybe she needs a douche room, Miss Molly. Maybe she needs a charge. Who knows? The denser could be all dirty, full of dirt. Can't breathe. It's like having 20 masks on going in a COVID shit. Can't breathe. You gotta clean the dust off. Could be a dirty filter. Who knows? I'm gonna go over there and see if I can figure out what's going on. He's supposedly he's home, so. We're on our way over there to see what we can do for this cat. It's a micro channel. Look at that. That wonderful. It's an old two. It's got gas in it. He's gonna, it's 410A. It's 10 years old. Three ton unit. He's gonna start it. We're gonna check the charge. I told him about the micro channel that it's probably a leaker. We'll find out. above 100. See that 58 right there? Yeah. That's going to be above 100. Yeah, what is that? That's the, that's the suction line. Let me show you. 58, the, 58 the PSI on 410, right? Here's 410, the 41 n right? Fifty-nine, so that's 60, 60 psi. It's ten degrees. It, it lights up. We gotta, we gotta put, we gotta put some gas in it. It's low. We at sixty. She's too low. Feel this, it's not really coming out hot. Feel that? Wait till I'm done with the charge and you'll see the difference. Was it running all right last year? In the afternoon, it wouldn't it wouldn't want to cool, huh? It just takes well, a long time. See how sub cooling there? How low that is? 1.2. That's really low. It ain't gonna it ain't gonna take a lot to charge it because it's not this thing don't take a lot of freon. Obviously, you got a leak somewhere, you know. Oh. But we're gonna charge it, gonna set it. We'll see how long the la how long the charge lasts. Yeah. What, just just recently? May. These micro channels are known to leak really bad, unfortunately. A lot of air conditioners, after 10 years, they start leaking. 
because this is the 410A, it runs a lot higher pressure. You know, it's out of warranty. After five years, it's out of warranty, you know? Let's put a little juice in it and let's see what, how long, what, what happens here. Yeah, that's what I would do. You want to start spending a lot of money on it, you know, because it's already, you know what I mean? Uh, you know, like, uh, this is a three ton. This is a three ton, yeah. 36. What's he got inside? Has he got a York unit inside also? A York unit? They had a lot of problems with their coils leaking too. All right, see now we're, we're above 100 here on a suction. Let's let it run and we'll see how it stabilizes. See, our, our superheat's gonna come down more, but we're above 100 now, so that's above freezing. Before at 60, the thing would have iced up because it was really cold. The lower the pressure, the lower the temperature. I'm gonna probably have to put a little bit more in there, but. The only thing good about these micro channels is they don't hold a lot of refrigerant. That's the only good thing about them. They might put a charge in that might be good for a year, year and a half, I don't know. You know what I mean? Depends on how bad the leak is. You just started it up this year? Well, you notice it's struggling this year. I actually only notice when it gets really hot. Yeah, like 90 and it's like something. Once, once I get it up to power, I'm going to show you what to look for and you'll be able to tell, okay? suction it starts dropping we know it's coming back it's starting to come back now yeah see it dropping we're getting close here now it's looking a lot better So you do research on YouTube and you've seen the micro channel? No, I didn't look into that. No. I was looking at the, the problem. What kind of filters are you running inside? Uh, I have to go buy a home team. Yeah, you wanna uh, you wanna buy the cheap ones? Before I actually bought a 10, that's the better one, thinking that was better. Yeah, it's not. Yeah, no, no, no. So you need, you need airflow. Yeah, you're better off with the four. Yeah, don't run any more than the four. Now feel the air coming out the top of this. How warm it is compared to before. before. You notice a big difference? Yeah. Lot, lot big difference. You're getting rid of the heat from the house before because it was really low. So. Alright, so see we're at one we're at 140, 140 there on a the suction, which is good. Our superheat's about 20, 20. It's gonna drop, keep dropping, that's about what we want. Subcooling's a little high, but gotta go by superheat on this. And this line's gonna start getting cold here. See this, see this line in the back here? The suction line. See how it's sweating? Can you see it? Yeah, that's that, that's the part. Until see yesterday. how it's sweating? Until yesterday, I can't have heard that the unit working. I said, so maybe the pump is not there. No, no, it was because definitely it was definitely low on charge. Because they usually say if it's low or whatever, and you see that getting freezer uh, frozen. You gotta put you gotta put the gauges on it. And you gotta you know I I can tell more or less by feeling things if if it's close or not because I've done it for so long. You have a professional eye on it. Yeah, yeah. See, all right, so we're 140, our superheat's right around 20, and uh, that's that's charged. So we're going to let it go and see how long it goes before you start spending all kinds of money on it. Uh, un 
unfortunately it's a micro channel, you know? And you can see if this was a copper coil, that was a copper or a round tube, it would be a lot better. It would hold so more refrigerant. Which ones are better? The, this, these, these, they stopped making them. A bad, bad design. So York and Ali is better too? Huh? The York and Ali is better? Or? The York's no longer making these micro channels. They stopped them because they had so many problems with so, them. So, but they make still some, but the better ones, right? Yeah, they make the, they make the, uh, it's two, it's round tube now. It's a uh, tube and fin. It's not that flat. That micro channel is a flat thing with like six, six or seven holes on that flat tube. So that's where they leak because it's a bad design. Think about how flat that is, and you gotta get three, you gotta get six holes in there all the way through. I mean, how stupid is that? That's pretty stupid, isn't it? You the figure they them cutting, cutting costs. Cutting costs, yeah, yeah, that's exactly what it was. All right, so we're gonna leave it right there. 350, 340 pounds there. That's a lot, that's 410 there. I mean, it runs, it runs on a hot day, it's high pressure, so that's why a lot of them will leak. Forty pounds. I mean, that's pretty high. 